Welcome back my lovelies. Today it's all about a new hair tool or redesigned. It's the T3 curling iron, the interchangeable curling iron that you can change the heads with just the one base. So this is their new T3 switch kit and they sent me the curl trio along with the wave trio. And each kit retails at 299 US dollars. And you can also build your own kit online. I think there are a total of eight different barrels. There are clips and wands. And today we're gonna use, which is their newest, newest little tiny little barrel. This is their 0.5 inch wand. Look how tiny she is. I'm excited. I think it's going to take a little bit to curl my entire head, but we're going to time it and see how fast and how effortless my hair looks in the end. You're probably wondering or asking this question, is the new T3 curling iron interchangeable with the older base or the barrels? Unfortunately, they're not. We tried to make it work. We tried to do the new barrels with the old base, the new base with the old, old barrels and vice versa and just nothing worked. But let's talk about what the new features are. So the new curling iron by T3, the base itself is very lightweight. It offers nine heat settings versus the old one. It has a little bit more weight. It's not super heavy, but it is, I want to say it's not as cheap feeling as the new one, but the heat settings, you only had five heat settings with the original T3 curling iron. And the biggest, my favorite update or upgrade is the lock mechanism. So the old one, you had to do this thing where you had to like push it and force it to the side to open. And a lot of the times my curling iron or barrel would get stuck and I would have to really force it out of there. So the new one, this is so nice. It also is a little stand for your curling iron. You just, you just go up and down to unlock it. You push it back in and then you just go horizontally to lock it. It's so nice that even the way it feels and the little clicks, it feels nice and secure and if it just looks better. And this little stand, it has a rubber foot or rubber, a rubber stand and it stands nicely on your desk without rotating back and forth. Let's turn it on. Like I said, they have nine heat settings and it's like the typical T3 where it lights lights up as it heats up and you can choose your heat settings. Let's go up to maybe five. The unfortunate part, they don't tell you on the iron what the temperature is. Correct. You have to look through the paperwork. Yes. So it starts at 127 degrees Celsius or 260 degrees Fahrenheit, which is the first one. And then the highest is 410 degrees Fahrenheit or 210 Celsius. So if you have fine hair, stick between one and four, medium hair, five and six, and then coarse, seven to nine. I'm between like fine, but I wanna go up to medium, which is the number five. Five is 350 degrees Fahrenheit, and I'm okay with that. I've already prepped my hair using the Bumble and Bumble, the invisible oil heat primer. And I have to do this at least 10 minutes before I do my hair because it is, it's a very wet primer. I already brushed my hair through, sectioned my hair, and let's begin. And the way I'm gonna be wrapping it around the wand is twisting it as I go around it, not laying flat. What was that, 10 seconds? Oh, okay, let's see. Oh, wow. I'm kind of liking that. Okay, and I'm not taking really small sections either. Again, I'm twisting around the T3 curling iron, the 0.5 inch barrel wand. <laughs> Andre's gonna time it for me. 10 seconds? Let's do 15, okay? Like 15 seconds? Yeah, I think 15 seconds is doable. I haven't used such a small little wand since the chopstick styler. And I haven't used a chopstick styler in, I wanna say at least two years. I don't think I've used it since Emirate was born. He's already, he's almost three. We'll do 15 for the bigger sections, 10 for the smaller ones. Oh yeah. Wow, very bouncy too. It's very smooth. I like the way it feels, but it feels like the rest of the T3, which I appreciate. They have a very glossy feel to them. The way it slides off, it's very smooth. Ah, ooh, gentle Milana. I believe each T3 uh, switch kit offers a glove, just to make sure you don't burn yourself.
Ooh, that was perfection. <laughs> We're doing 10 on the smaller sections, 15 seconds on the bigger sections. Now I'm trying to go maybe like half an inch off the barrel. Okay. <laughs> Stretch that out a little bit. These barrels are made from something that they call Cerama gloss. It's supposed to be extremely smooth on your hair, resulting with shiny, frizz-free hairstyle, which usually that's kind of what I get from T3, even with the original T3 curling iron. But you see that, just because it is so tight and my hair is fine in texture, usually my curls, they look a little frizzy with the, with the like really tiny curling irons. The barrel does feel really glossy and smooth. Like I think once you get into the rhythm, you'll fly through this, but I am taking smaller sections. You can see the way it comes off the curling iron and there's still so much room left on the barrel itself. So if you do have really long hair, I think you'll be fine. Yeah, I'm happy with 10. I mean, just look at that. Wow. I am sweating though, I will be honest. Another cool thing is you can rest the bottom on your palm or in your palm because it's cool to the touch, so it's not hot. And if it feels like the curling iron is losing um, tension, just gently roll it towards your scalp and it's gonna hold. So here are the initial results <laughs> with the new T3 curling iron using the 0.5 inch, which is their smallest barrel. I think this is gonna be perfect for those that already have curly hair and you just wanna define some of the curls. Or if you have wavy hair, straight hair, fine hair like myself, and you wanted to experience really tight ringlet curls, your dreams have come true. <laughs> I'm gonna let this set for a little bit and then we're gonna come back and I'm going to either brush it through or just take the hair apart, the curls apart, and just finesse it a little bit. Just taking the curls apart a little bit to add a little bit more movement, volume, and I am going to brush it out, but we're gonna first see what this looks like. I know there's so many of you that are screaming right now, no, don't brush them out. I'm curious what it's gonna look like. The bottom ones have fallen, but I didn't really hold it for too long on the bottom ones. If I didn't think I would just go back and fix it because it looks like I have extensions in my hair right now. Do you see this? <laughs> yeah. Just waiting for it to heat back up. And we're using the five. I will say I can actually run my hands or fingers through my hair relatively without <laughs> ripping my hair out, but there are some sections that are not as smooth. But I think that's due to um, the curls alternating. Taking a little bit of Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. I'm just gonna run this through mids to the ends of my hair. I want it softened. Okay, I do look a little frizzy, but again, this is not my natural curls, and I think it is going to tone down a little bit as the day goes on. But overall, I like that I still have quite a bit of body. I have movement in my hair, and this took, I thought it was gonna take a lot longer. It took less than 20 minutes from start to finish with me like talking to you guys, demonstrating. So I think all in all, when I get more comfortable with it, it's gonna probably be 15 minutes or less to get the entire head done. Well, my hair. All in all, I do like the improvements for the new T3 curling iron. I appreciate that they added four more heat settings. I also really appreciate the new locking mechanism. It's very easy. It's very smooth. I do like the clicks. Again, it's all about the experience, right? I like the new barrel that they added. I'm hoping they're gonna add new barrels and new clips to the collection, like the reverse ta tapered barrel. I don't like that you can't interchange the barrels. If you already have the old original system, it's unfortunate. I don't know why they did that. Maybe it's better better heating technology that they have available. The ceramic coating is probably better. I'm looking right now and it does feel a little more glossy and it looks more glossy. 
new versus old. I will say this is easier to open. I always find that the old T3 or the original T3 barrels, especially the clips, they're very sticky and tight. Personally, myself, <laughs> I like to see what temperature I'm on. I don't like these little indicators just because I don't know what temperature I'm at. Obviously now I know number five is 350, but I, I wish they actually told me what the temperature was. That way I don't have to go into the booklet and kind of like memorize it. I wish they had a heat setting right here somewhere, maybe even into, in the on button. They can still have the indicators, but it would be cool if they had like a LCD little screen. I'm gonna leave it here. I do like most of the updates, but again, the biggest drawback is you can't interchange the barrels with new, old, old, new with a T3 curling iron, but take it as you will. I like the overall results with the 0.5 inch. I think this is gonna be phenomenal for those that already have curly hair and those that don't and want to style and see what it feels like to have curly hair for a day, for two days, for three days. And I will say with my experience using T3 for many years, the curling irons, their wands, their barrels, they do last a really long time or they help to extend the longevity of my curls or waves for at least two, three days until I wash my hair or I have to restyle it. But it, the curls don't fall out at the end of the day from my experience using T3 curling irons. I know you all want to see this. I'm just taking a comb. This is actually going to soften it. It's going to add volume and frizz for now, but the more I go over it, it's going to become softer. My natural hair is fine, too like straight, too sometimes wavy. But do we see this? That's also very pretty. Before. after. Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here. Thank you for watching, spending time with me, and I'll see the next one very soon.